Hey everyone, I'm down here at the lake, and guess what? I just started this video a few minutes ago. This is part two, but part one is never going to get uploaded. <laughs> but I was down here walking and talking to you and showing you why I'm down here. And, well, let me just tell you. I'm down here because I wanted to get some of these branches. Now, I don't know if these are pine or what. They smell like pine, but I never see any pine needles. And they're different kinds of trees, if that makes any sense. I know they look alike, but one of them has little, like, blue berries on them. And then the others don't. And then, I'll oh, see, I can show you. See? These little blueberries. I mean, I'm sure you can't eat them. And so that tree has them. This tree doesn't. And the, neither does that one, and neither does that one. But this tree and that tree, the needles are different. I can't explain it. Someone left the glove. I can't explain it, but it's just they're different. And this one doesn't smell like pine. That one does smell like pine. Okay, well, what I was doing was I was getting me some different greenery from these different trees and I had to hold the phone with my left hand which is my bad side and break my branches with my right hand which is better than the left and I was doing that and I was putting my branches on the ground and going to all these different trees and talking to you and then I had some branches in my hand and I was looking for my little pile of branches that I put down. I could not find it. I did find it, but while I was talking to you, I couldn't find it. And <clears throat> while I was doing all that, with my left hand, I hit something on my phone and it shut my phone off. So I had to... um turn it back on and here I am and now I'm looking again for let's see I walked up here to call you oh there it is I'll show you there's my little stack and I got some brown ones too so I plan on making something now it's not not really a wreath because I'm not a wreath maker but I wish I was I have friends back home that we've been friends since high school and their mother used to make wreaths out of pine and pine cones and let's see pine branches and pine cones and she used to make wreaths out of fabric she's the one that had a little craft shop in her garage and she used to sell her wreaths were her big sellers and she sold her crocheting and her knitting Back then, in the 80s, um, now see this, I want to get some of these too. This kind of greenery is different than those. It's like, it's more flatter or something, I can't explain it. Um, yeah, back then you could go to City Hall if you owned your own house and you had a, a little garage, you could pay for a permit to have a little business so she had a little craft business craft shop in her garage and we knew someone else that had a um, little carpentry business look at over there how bare all those trees are and that water it's sprinkling it's about 59 degrees oh A duck. I hear someone's rooster. 
Oh, another duck. So I'm going to, when I get home, I'm going to start making my craft project with these uh, pine branches. Lots of ducks. Let's see if I can make this. Look at that. Now when I um, pulled up into the parking lot, oh, you know how I hate to see trash here. I just don't understand why you would leave trash. Um, when I pulled up into the parking lot, there was a couple guys walking out of here and they told me that they caught some um, crappie fish. And this is crappie season, I think, till like oh, February or March, I've been told. I've never had crappie that I know of. Now that. Okay. So I hope I can make this craft that I want to make. I already started it this morning and oh boy it was hard on my hands. It's not crochet obviously. It's with branches. I just don't know if I have enough. I wanted different sizes. Let me let me gather up these. I think I do have enough. And I got some of those dead ones because that's a nice um, different kind of color to add. And I want some of this one. So I was telling you, I showed you that tree down there. But it, this is the same kind. And the, um, I can't explain it. It's flatter and it's kind of, kind of almost like feathery. So that'll be good. Cause it'll be a contrast. It's, um, sprinkling, but it's kind of getting heavier than a sprinkle. Okay, I got a, got a couple pieces. Now look at that one. It's way down there. Someone left pumpkins here. Now just one branch from this might be nice. I don't know. Can you hear the rain? It's a little heavier than a sprinkle. Let's see. I think just one branch of this. I'll try to use. Pumpkins there. Pumpkins over there. I think they left them for the wildlife, but I also think they might have, um, had candles in them for Halloween or, or maybe it's just rotting black. I don't know, but it doesn't look like um, animals are eating them. There's lots of them. So I'm going to get out of here because the rain is getting a little bit heavy. You know what? I didn't bring a bag for this, which is fine. I mean, my car needs to be vacuumed anyway, but it just would have been easier. Do I cut them all? Yep. Cut them all. Now, what am I going to make with these, you're wondering? More pumpkins. More more.
gotta watch out for these stumps. Cause boy, you can fall on your face. Those are pumpkins. Okay. Put these in the car. Of course. Of course. The door is locked. You hear that rooster? I don't know why. Oh, I think out here you can have rooster. Well, I don't know. I mean, this is out here is country, but where that rooster's coming from is the subdivision. Look at someone came and dumped all their leaves here and concrete. All right, I'm going to get out of the rain.